Hello everyone and welcome to Bevan's Bricks. In today's video is going to be a recap for the LEGO Masters Grand Finale and the winner announcement. So stick around because it's coming up. Now today's episode of LEGO Masters was a little bit more unique and the reason is is we only had the three teams as you see here and they're all playing for the rights to have the Builder's Cup, if you will, <laughs> the Lego Master's Cup, and a uh, $100,000 prize is on the table. Now, with that being said, obviously it was going to be a very dramatic, very long, very difficult build. And how this particular episode started out is they were all given one hour to come up with an idea and present it to the Lego Masters. So the first team up is Sam and Jessica, and they came up with the idea of the Peacock and the Monkey. Next up, we have Mark and Boone, and they came up with the idea of the Tower of Creativity. And last, but certainly not least, we have Tyler and Amy, and they came up with the idea of the Treasure of the Griffin. Now, after presenting their ideas, the LEGO Masters weren't real happy with Mark and Boone's uh, particular submission that they came up with because they felt that it was, and it actually kind of did, uh, felt like it looked like it was something that came from uh, the build that they made and it was either episode three or four if I'm not mistaken So they came up with a new idea a kind of a different spin on their original idea anyway Artopia is what they were calling it and then they were all given 24 hours to build their ideas that they presented to the Lego masters and build each and every team did for 11 straight hours and then at the 13 hour mark, they were all given a really pleasant and welcome surprise to each and every team, which was a nice friendly visit from their family, which they brought everybody out onto stage and let them introduce them and kind of see what they were up to. Well, after their happy little visit, it was back to building and building they did. They all did a wonderful job and I'm gonna go ahead and start showing you some clips of their builds right now. Now here you can see they have all their builds in the middle of the build floor and then now we're going to show you some close-ups of these. First we have Sam and Jessica's Peacock and the Monkey. And here, I mean, that was a really fantastic build, a really unique use of pieces and everything with this build. Uh, they did a really wonderful job. Next up we have Tyler and Amy's build, which was called the Treasure of the Griffin. Uh, and they really had a very unique build. They had some really cool looking sculptures. And what it was is the griffin, as you can see in some of these pictures, the wings actually moved and flapped. And the premise of the build was that the griffin was protecting its nest from the dragon. Now, last but certainly not least, we had Mark and Boone with Artopia. And they had some really unique stuff going on, a lot of color. Uh, what it was is basically the art people were taking over the city and they were trying to make it beautiful from this old archaic looking vision it once was. And they had some movement in theirs too, because when you put the paintbrush in a little paint can next to it, some of the stuff on the buildings would flip around and show a new uh, revealed ending. But anyway, as with any show, <laughs> there can only be one winner. Uh, as you could just see that there was three fantastic builds and I thought they all did a wonderful job. Uh, me personally, I felt that uh, Sam and uh, Jessica, they really grew well as a couple. They didn't win though, they were last place, so let me say that. <laughs> Uh, the two top teams, in my opinion, were obviously Mark and Boone and Tyler and Amy. And, uh, well, without further ado, I'll just go ahead and announce it. The actual winners of the competition were Tyler and Amy. And as you'll see in some of the images I'm showing you here, uh, they launched off a bunch of confetti and, and announced the winners. And obviously they, uh, they win the hundred thousand dollar prize and the trophy. So Tyler and Amy, fantastic job. Congratulations to you, uh, for a job well done. And that's it. Uh, that is all for this particular episode from Bevan's Bricks, which was the Lego uh, finale uh, recap. I hope you guys enjoyed this particular season or series. I will be making another series of this when the season two actually comes out and uh, to try and keep everybody informed for those of you that don't get a chance to see the show or at work or whatever else. But anyway, as always, uh, thank you for coming to Bevan's Bricks. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share below and we'll see you next time on Bevan's Bricks.